This is the first in a series of videos intended to help you learn how to use the FamilySearch Research Wiki. The Research Wiki is an encyclopedia just like Wikipedia, with the exception that all of the articles are about genealogy. Here you will find articles on basic genealogy skills and strategies. You will learn about the various record types that are available and how to find them. You will learn how to use strategies based on the location you are searching in. And you will find links to important online databases. Records about people's lives are made by governments or churches or other associations. And governments are organized by location. So genealogy records are organized by location. Advice about how to do genealogy is organized by location within the wiki. Some records are created by countries, some by the state or province or district, some by local counties. Some records are produced by a city or town, and sometimes a jurisdiction even smaller than the town, such as a church parish if the town is divided up into several parishes. Any of these can create genealogy records. And so you will want to check every jurisdiction that covers the place where your ancestors lived. Hopefully, in each location you study, you'll find clues to the location they came from so that you can then go do genealogy in that new location. To get to the Family Search Research Wiki, this is the URL address, which is also listed on the YouTube page in the notes below this video. And this is the Wiki main page. The Wiki can be searched by place or by topic. You can type your place or topic in this search box or in the search box in the top right corner. Your other option is to use this clickable map. For South Carolina, I would click on North America. I would then click on the United States and I would come to information and articles about United States records. When I was done with those, I would scroll down to the map of the states. Here I would click on South Carolina. I would then come to articles about genealogy records for the state of South Carolina. When I had finished using those, I would go down to this map of counties and choose the county I want. I would then come to an article about genealogy records available specifically for that county. I don't mean to imply that you always do genealogy in the order of United States, then the state, then the county. Depending on the logic of the records, you might start with the county and you might start with the state. Let's look at some of the features you would find on a state or country main page. This section, Getting Started, will have many articles which are helpful for beginners. In this section, you will find research tools. In the United States, that will be things like gazetteers, but in a foreign country, it may include foreign language word lists. Over here, we have the right sidebar and articles about the record types. You will learn more about this sidebar in the next lesson. This button will lead you to the South Carolina Online Genealogy Records page. Basically, the state main page or a country main page acts as an index to all the various articles that can teach you about genealogy in that locality. Now you try it. Find the main page for your country. Find the state or province page for where one of your ancestors lived. Study the different features available and practice navigating through the wiki. When you feel comfortable with those skills, move on to the next lesson, learning about records.